Pollination is a digital fashion show. We're showcasing 13 fantastic Pacific fashion designers tonight. I have been talking to the team from Pacific Corporation Foundation for a few years now, so it's really nice that we were able to partner this year. For us as a collaborative partner, we like to see people work around the edges, and Nora is known for pushing the envelope, being a risk taker, um, and also being brave. We really see this as an opportunity to start a partnership where we can continue to promote uh, Pacific designers in the region and bring new opportunities to them. So we're really, really happy to be partnered with Nora Swan and her Pacific Fusion Fashion Show. And yeah, just, you know, keep promoting fashion as an amazing um, economic and social development tool for our people. I think it's incredibly important to show that there is value in the creative sector and also for people to come together and celebrate the work that they've done. I think it's really important that we look at how we commercialise Pacific Māori fashion to the world in an authentic way. And tonight at Pollination we've done that. The beauty of Pollination is that it promotes our Pacific designers, but also this year we've featured three uh, regional designers. So even though the borders are closed, we did manage to just ensure that our designers in the region are still getting exposure. I'm really pleased with tonight's event and I'm so grateful to Nora and her team for putting it on and to Pacific Cooperation Foundation for their support. So this is a fantastic way to be able to show showcase our up and coming Pacific designers and then to showcase it to the world. These events are absolutely critical to make sure our Pacifica people have a chance to showcase their work locally and globally. I'm excited to see all the models showing everyone's work and then also seeing my work shown for the first time. It's a surreal experience. We've got big people coming, such a huge production. Um, it's lovely just mixing and mingling with people and getting our work out on show. You don't often get these opportunities, so when you get them, you've got to jump right into it, take what you can get um, just to succeed. I think it's really important that the Pacific Fusion Fashion platform exists because it allows our designers to share their stories in a, an ecosystem where they can feel comfortable in. So, you know, Pacifica designers, Pacifica models, Pacifica production team, it pretty much is home, it's family. This is uh, an opportunity for them to really break in. Um, for a lot of them, they've been designing on the side, making a few outfits for family and friends, or they may be selling online already. However, to really get their creative juices going, a fashion show always, I guess, stretches them to that next level. Sometimes all it takes is just a chance or an opportunity to showcase your design, your talent, and one person can see and be like, look, I love what you did. We love for us to collaborate or to put it in the store. And I think just little door openers like that is so important. I first developed a sort of taste for fashion a couple of years ago. And then I wanted to slowly pursue that a bit more, making my own clothes. Wanted it to fit perfectly, have the function I wanted. So I decided to take the next step and study it. I like the brain work that goes into it and actually being able to make my garments from scratch, from planning out the patterns to knowing how to put everything together after that as well. I particularly enjoyed the range of designers that were displayed, the diversity of the models, and um, just to be able to come to a fashion show and see myself and my friends and family completely represented in the models who were displaying the work. I'm really proud of all the designers tonight and also the models, um, the confidence and the attitude that they gave on that catwalk was just absolutely amazing and I'm just so proud of our Pacific women to be showcasing their bodies, who they are, as well as obviously really showing off our Pacific designers creations. There were two things that really stood out for me tonight. One was our plus size models and the sassiness that they brought to all of their designs and the designers. The other one was Dan Dagger. He paid tribute to what we've just come through COVID with the masks. And I thought, actually, yeah, that's where we are. So fashion belongs in all, all things, including COVID. So congratulations to everyone. I think this has kind of solidified for me that I'd like to continue designing. Yeah, see where that takes me. I definitely want to start up a brand with my brother. Um, so that's the next step and then eventually just being in a position to offer opportunities for other Pacifica and Māori students and adults, yeah. Do whatever is your passion because it means that every day you wake up and it's not a chore, it's not a job and you're just sharing your talents with the rest of the country and the rest of the world, so go for it.